Yo, 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 what's up with everybody? Your boy here, Kali Muscle. Urgh, swole as ever, man. And today we're going to be doing some triceps, man. Uh, for years, triceps was a lagging body part for me. Uh, I don't know, you know, I guess I wasn't hitting them right. A lot of people think they're supposed to go super heavy, do a lot of uh, skull crushers, a lot of uh, kickbacks with dumbbells where they're not really keeping attention on the muscle. So it actually took me like over 25 years to learn how to train triceps correctly. Cause I got old videos from back in the day where I'm just with a hundred pound dumbbells kicking them back. Yeah, we got these hundred now. Yeah, that's 100. Now, don't believe that each one is 10 pounds. Each plate is 10 pounds. So 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. 100 pounds on the back one. So, you know what I mean? So, Leave it. You go to iron. That's a hundred. Hundred pounds. So now we're about to back on that. Here we go. Now we're about to back on that. Light it, light it. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, nine, six. Yeah. Y'all don't believe it, huh? Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, six. That's a good thing. That's a good thing. That's a real eye. Now on my, what's that, right arm, it got a little tension in it, so I had to spot myself like two, three reps. And I wasn't keeping tension on the muscle. I never even had got sore on my triceps until after 25 years of training. And so I'm going to take you guys through my uh, tricep routine, and it varies each week. Uh, you know, sometimes uh, I don't do overhead tricep extension with the cables. Uh, I don't do... Uh, uh tricep uh on the bench reverse uh so i alternate have fun with it but my overall objective is to pump the muscle full as blood as i can and keep the tension while doing so all right so let's get to it so here we go we about to do one arm tricep rope extensions four to five sets to failure i usually start off with this uh and i usually do this movement every tricep workout uh i've learned that this has uh this exercise right here has got my triceps the biggest man uh, i'm keeping attention on it i can focus on the muscle uh you know and doing unilateral one at a time you really can focus in on the muscle and so i love doing these right here and triceps i usually do every workout so you talking about anywhere from three to six days a week i'll do triceps so my objective right here is to squeeze, pump and muscle in it, get that full extension at the bottom. You know, that's what you wanna do. You wanna get that full extension at the bottom. So you squeezing it, pumping it. And right here you see now they pumped up, vascularity is there. Uh, I never had like a real, uh, like some people you see have a real defined tricep horseshoe. Like mine never really got like that. You know, uh, when I really diet down hard and get super dry, it's more detailed, but not when I'm just uh, shredded on the natural year round. I would have to really deplete myself and dry out for a show to really see serious horseshoe action. And so, you know, everybody got their good and bad parts and uh, triceps is a work in progress for me. So right here, we got dumbbell skull crushers. Of course, we're going four to five sets of failure. I used to go super, super heavy on these, man, and uh, now I don't. These, though, cause a lot of elbow problems, so you want to be careful with these, man. If they hurt your elbows, you're in pain, stop doing them, bro. Uh, these, though, are less painful than doing the bar because you got more freedom of movement and uh, you're not locked in a, a position that's going to have your elbows hurting. Whatever you want to do in this bodybuilding fitness stuff, you don't never want to be in pain, man. When you see dudes up with uh, 
fucking uh, uh, arm sleeves, uh, knee wraps. They in pain, bro. You don't want to be like these guys, all right? I'm trying to teach my youngsters and OGs, man. A lot of OGs follow me, and they doing stuff that's causing them pain. You never want to be in pain, man. So, uh, and it took me years to learn that. I used to do dumbbell kickbacks like this with 100-pound dumbbells. Elbows be aching. And so, yeah, you don't want to do that. So next, we're going to tricep press down. Cambrid bar, four to five sets of failure right here. Squeezing at the bottom. Triceps, actually, you know, people ask me how to get big triceps. All you can do for triceps is press downs or kickbacks. That's it, man. But the objective is to get in that mind-muscle connection and get the pump. A lot of people don't know how to get the pump. You relax the muscle. And like I say, I was one of those people for years. I thought you had to go super heavy and just move the weight around however you could. But now being a bodybuilder, you want to be an artist. You want to, uh, you know, feel the muscle, put your mind in the muscle. And, you know, that's why I tell people I've never been able to listen to headphones working out because I, I got to have mind-muscle connection. There you go. Get that flex on, boy. Look at them guns. 24 for 20, 20 niggas and wiggers and chiniggas and mexa diggers. Yeah. So now we about to do uh, overhead rope tricep extension, fortify set to failure. You know, uh, right here we pumping it overhead, getting that squeeze, getting the stretch. But you never want to feel like the muscle is relaxed. You know what I'm saying? Uh, this is, you know, one of my least favorite exercises because I feel the tension. But when you come back, the muscles tend to relax. So you got to really focus in and get that uh, tension on it. You know what I'm talking about? So, yeah, we squeezing right here. My, my mind is in my tricep. I want them to look big as uh, Mount Everest. You know what I'm saying? Mount Kilimanjaro or something. Yeah. So here we go. We squeeze them right here. Oh, we're doing a bench, reverse bench, tricep uh, push-ups, whatever they call. <laughs> so here, uh, I, I haven't did these in years. I decided to do them here. And so we just press and squeeze them up top and press and squeeze them up top. And they got pumped off these. Actually, man, these felt real good for me not to have done them for years. So, yeah, man, that's it. That's the tricep uh, routine that I did today. Uh, we're going to keep pumping out these videos, man. We're going to keep uh, pumping blood in and keeping that tension. You know what I'm talking about? You never, you never want to give up. You never want to give up. You hear me? 2020 is our year, man. A lot of uh, stuff already done transpired that, you know, uh, got a, a lot of us reflecting on life. Uh, and I must say RIP to Kobe, man, that just, I never thought that a non-relative or non-friend uh, that I talk to on the phone every day would affect my life like it has, you know what I mean? And so, you know, I just want to say to all y'all, man, be the best person you can be while you're here. You never know when your day is to come, man, you know, uh. You know, Kobe dying really, like, just had me reflecting. You know, I got my two kids now, and so it just, man, you got to be better people, man. You know, this working out, being buff, and internet is cool, but there's more to life. You know what I mean? Uh, I'm going to try to inspire you as much as I can and have fun doing it. You know, I'm still going to be collie bustle and talk crap here and there, but the overall objective is to motivate, inspire y'all to be better people, you know, not to put harmful things in your body, not to destroy your body, because everybody that we see in the bodybuilder, fitness, powerlifting world, they, they, they doing them, they trying to act tough for you guys, they trying to lift the most weight for you guys, and then tell y'all go try to do what they do and injure yourself, and you go, uh, ruin your life, be trying, how ain't trying to lift weights or being buff. So I'm here to try to bring it to y'all, man, where you can get it simple, easy, without injuring yourself and live as long as you can. So with that, I love y'all. Keep pushing for success. Man, listen to your boy, man. I'm going a, I'm to a, hey, I'm a lead y'all the right way, man. I'm not going to, uh, you know, lead you into the pits of hell. You know what I mean? I don't live that lifestyle no more. And, hey, I want to go into the pearly hates of heaven so I can meet up with Kobe and all the rest of the good people that's in heaven, man. I love y'all, man. Keep pushing for success. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. We all, we like 8,000 away from 2 million. 
So help your boy out. Make sure you follow me on Facebook. We got like 2.2 million over there. Instagram. Make sure you follow me on there because I do post IGTV videos on there, man. And, uh, man, I love y'all. Make sure y'all follow my vlog channel where it's all family oriented. Uh, I had the kids on there. My girl, Helena. Uh, no cursing. You know, it's an all kid friendly, man. Hyphy family. I love y'all, man. See you on the next one. Boom! Come on, face. Oh, that face detection. That face detection. Cut the camera. What does it take to be extreme? Kali Muscle takes his workouts to the extreme with Hyphy Mud and Hyphy Aminos. Hyphy Mud and Hyphy Aminos increases strength, energy, focus, endurance, builds lean muscle, and enhances recovery. Get the most out of your workouts. Be a part of Team Hyphy with Hyphy Mud and Hyphy Aminos. Be a part of Team Hyphy. Order your Hyphy Mud and Hyphy Aminos today. <sighs> ba -ba -ba